The Stour Bridge Lion was commissioned by Horatio Allen of the Delaware and Hudson Canal Company. He had studied the technology which was emerging in Britain and was impressed by what he saw, so he ordered four engines from Foster Rustrick and Company in Stourbridge, though the line was the only one that would ever run. It was placed in the line on August of 1829. Though he had never driven a steam train before, Allen took it out on his own for the first run of a steam train on a serving American railway. It ran well, covering the three miles, five kilometres of the track back and forth, much to the delight of the viewing crowd. However, it was twice as heavy as the weight specified for the line, and so it was never used again. Attempts were made to sell the engine, but none were successful, and so it was just gradually stripped for parts and materials over the years. In 1890, the Smithsonian Institute purchased the boiler and a few other stray parts for preservation. A fully working replica was built in 1932.